we're talking about hundreds of thousands of people all gathering in one place and it's the most amazing spectacle you could see but you can't ignore the fact that there are thousands of leopards there. The use in the trade of leopard skins is something new for us from a conservation aspect. We're all focusing on hunting and illegal persecution and prey depletion and then all of a sudden we started seeing, hang on, there's a few of these leopards that are being targeted. Where are they going? The state of African leopards is that they're decreasing. We know that they've already lost over 30% of their historical home range. And where they do occur, they had lower densities than they were historically. And also in little areas that we're looking at leopards, we're seeing that their numbers are being reduced. And this is all because they're the most persecuted big cat species in the world. So this whole program started by me attending one of these Shambi festivals. It was a very small one outside of Pinda Private Game Reserve. But I walked there, the first thing I noticed was 200 dancers wearing leopard skins. The second one I went to, I counted over a thousand leopard skins. And then I realized every time I go back, there's more and more. That's why Panthera's First for Life program was established, and now we're working hard at trying to work with the church to come up with these solutions. Culture and tradition and conservation can work hand in hand. And with Panthera First for Life program, we prove it. The slogan is conserving the future. We, we're talking about conserving wildlife whilst conserving culture and tradition. The future for leopard conservation is in us doing, making a difference now. Right now, they're not in danger, they're not threatened, but if we don't start conserving them now, they're gonna land up like tigers and lions. When it's too late, so we're gonna say, oh, we should have done something. If all of these aspects that we're looking at start working, then a hundred years time, there will be leopards for children to see. When people who love an animal so much start realizing they're impacting on it, we have a chance. And that's why we have an opportunity to be successful in this project. So we're doing something now. 